Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about my pre-flight skincare routine. Before we get started, I'd like to let you know that my skin is more on the dry side. So most, if not all of my products are meant for dry skin or combination skin. Just a heads up for you guys. Okay, so let's get started. So first, I cleanse my skin using the Dermalogica Special Cleansing Gel, which is like my all-time favorite. I have been using that for almost two decades. And since I'm a big fan of double cleansing, I would cleanse again using the Indie Lee Rose Hip Cleanser. I love how gentle this is and how it retains moisture on my skin. And sometimes once or twice a week, I would exfoliate using the Dermalogica Microfoliant. Since I have dry skin, I'm only allowed to exfoliate once or twice a week. If you have oily skin, you could exfoliate more. And this is so fine and so gentle that you could actually use it daily. Then we move on to the toner, which is the alcohol-free Thayer Switch Hazel Toner. Um, I love how this smells like rose petals. And I love how gentle it is on my skin. Moving on, this is the product that changed my skincare game. This is the SkinCeutical CE Ferulic, which is the vitamin C serum. Vitamin C is and should be every girl's best friend. It works wonders on my skin. It promotes collagen production. It helps with hyperpigmentation, it brightens your skin, it reduces wrinkles or signs of aging, it's hydrating, it evens out skin tone, it prevents you from sun damage. I mean, what else can you ask for, right? It is everything you need in life, practically. So, then we move on to SkinCeuticals Hyaluronic Acid. If you're not familiar with hyaluronic acid, this is exactly what you need if you want hydrated, supple, younger looking skin that's glowing. And this is the kind of moisture and hydration I want for my skin when I fly. So this is definitely very essential. Don't forget the neck. And I always try to give a pat the back of my hands. And because I'm flying and I need all the moisture and the hydration when I'm up there, I am adding SkinCeuticals Hydrating B5, which is a combination of B5 and hyaluronic acid. So more of that hyaluronic, please. Now we move on to the eyes. I have the SkinCeuticals HI Complex. This is best for dark under eyes, puffiness, and wrinkles. And I mean, we do need all the help we can get. <laughs> then we have the moisturizer, which is the Kiehl's Multi Corrective Cream. It has more hyaluronic acid, which I love. It's for firming, it's also anti aging, and it gives you the hydration that you need. It's all about hydration, guys, when you fly. You really have to think about hydrating your skin. Aside, of course, from the fact that you need to hydrate internally, you have to drink lots of water when you're in flight. It's the same for your skin. You have to keep your skin very well hydrated. Then we go to another must-have on our skincare routine, which is sunscreen SPF 50. I have La Roche Posay. I love this one specifically because it is anti-shine and when you're dealing with makeup, you don't want anything that looks greasy. It took a while for me to find a good sunscreen that is best with makeup and I'm happy that I found this one. Sunscreen is very important on a daily basis but much more when you're flying because you're flying all that recycled air and when you're up there, you're actually closer to the sun. So you are more exposed to the UV rays and you don't want that extra sun damage. And now that I've done all the steps of my skincare routine, I would spritz my face with this Mario Badesco Rose Water Facial Spray. 
just for that added, yes, you've guessed it, hydration before I put on my makeup. And then I'm ready to go on my flight. Thanks for watching, everyone. Mwah.